I'm Michaela Chavez at the Omni Hotel, where Choloso Midway ISD is holding their annual State of the District event. Dozens of associations, industries, and partners are showing their support for the district, with the district saying that community support is taking them into a new era in public education. Teloso Midway ISD used the event to show the community how the district is using grant money they have received. Linda Esquivel is a theater arts teacher at Teloso Midway Middle School. She said she applied for a grant and hopes to use money for student projects. We did utilize that to get a three-dimensional printer because we have tech classes as well as acting classes. So that really helped the students visually be able to create their own set pieces and it's been helping us tremendously, especially when we compete for UIL. Through a partnership with Texas A&M University Kingsville, the district has seen an increase in students taking dual enrollment classes. Tamuk hopes to show students that they can thrive in the area through their partnership with the school. For, for many years, it's been a deficit mindset uh, because most, most students want to leave. We're trying to encourage students to stay and fight for these communities so that we don't drain our communities of the talent pool that we have here in our young folks. The district says they're financially in a good spot right now, but they won't stop there. We have to keep our focus on the kids. TM has a rich history. We're financially sound, and our best days are ahead of us. Teluxo Midway ISD looks forward to their upcoming bond election, where that community support is needed to make changes to the district. Reporting in downtown Corpus Christi, Michaela Chavez, Chris 6 News.